Hey everyone, my name is Eric Sturman. I'm the founder of Sturman Aerials. We're out here today filming at La Ie Point with the Typhoon H. One of the functions that I really like about the Typhoon H is called Curved Cable Cam, which we're gonna use to film this beautiful island behind us. So how Curved Cable Cam works is you fly a route and as I'm going around the island, I'm gonna drop my pins. And each pin is gonna be the next destination that the Typhoon H is gonna go to. And in doing so, it's gonna allow me to take control of the camera and really get the unique shot that I wanna get. A great thing about Curve Cable Cam is it will remember the waypoints that you did and you can go back and forth. So if you wanna redo that shot multiple times, as long as the drone is flying, you can keep doing it and you can keep getting different angles, but with the same route. To use Curve Cable Cam feature, tap the system settings icon and choose other settings. Turn on advanced mode and tap the return button. Next, tap the task camera icon to select task. Then you will see five functions displayed on the screen. Tap Curve Cable Cam to enter the Curve Cable Cam function. Fly the Typhoon H to a point and tap the plus sign to create a new point and record the current flying position. Fly to the next point and tap the plus sign again to add a second point and so on. Please make sure the direct distance between any two points is more than 16 and a half feet. The points you set will appear in the top left hand corner of the screen. Tap the minus sign to delete the last point you created if needed. You can always tap reset to delete all the points created during the flight. Once you set your waypoints, you can tap save to save your current flight plan. Next, tap start and slide the icon. Typhoon H will fly back to waypoint one automatically. Slowly raise the throttle stick and the copter will fly along the waypoints in order from one forward. Slowly lower the throttle stick and it will fly the route in reverse. To allow control of the camera, switch the pan selection switch to global mode. Now you can control the camera using the right stick. 